Boston, CBS, heading into last year's postseason, the number one and number two and number three concern about the Boston Red Sox was their bullpen. Yet with baseball being baseball, the one reliable reliever, Craig Kimbrell, had a rough playoffs, while the rest of the bullpen was nearly perfect en route to a World Series run. This year, the Sox appear comfortable in not re-signing Kimbrell, and instead going with in-house options like Matt Barnes, Ryan Brazier, and or Tyler Thornburg. In the latest edition of Slice of Sully, WBZ TV sports producer Scott Sullivan wondered if this is an arrogant decision, or whether it might all work out once again for the Red Sox. It feels a little arrogant to me that they're going with their own guys instead of maybe going out and signing somebody or perhaps bringing Kimbrell back, Sullivan said to Steve Burton. But everything worked out last year, maybe it keeps working out again, Sullivan is okay with the Red Sox moving on from Kimbrell, after the closer posted a 5.91 era in 1.594 whip in nine postseason appearances last October. Still, that doesn't mean that whoever gets thrust into the closer's role will be able to handle it. I'm just not sure if Barnes is ready to handle that position, Sullivan said. It's a different role to be a closer. Instead of the 7th or 8th inning, you've got to be really tough-minded. Not everybody can close. You just can't all of a sudden come into the ninth and start doing it. Some guys can do it, some can't. I'm not sure if Barnes can do it, I'm not sure if Brazier can do it, Thornburg. I mean, we haven't seen Thornburg in two years. So the candidates are, I like Brazier and Barnes, but as closers, I'm not so sure about that. Sully also talked about whether Chris Sale can last the whole season, and whether the Red Sox and Alex Cora can manage to repeat as champions. Watch in the video above.